I, I think it's experience. I mean, you got to go in life and, and in football, you got to go through some, some tough times. You're just, just not going to wear a ring um, without it. So I, I think it's, it's just part of the process. Um, and, you know, the guys could have gone one way or the other when we were 0-6 and, and, and then they bounced back and kind of had a feeling, they got a feeling of what it's like to win at least two games in a row. And maybe for some programs that's not a big deal, but I think it certainly was for us. And, um, and I saw that carry over to spring and certainly their attitude and not just on the football field, but in all walks of life, how, how they handle themselves socially, what they're like in a classroom. Um, you know, kind of understanding really what it takes to be a, a, a Division One student athlete. Well, I'd be excited for the players. Um, you know, that's certainly, you know, anytime you're, you, you set a goal and you reach it, then you got to say you had a successful season. So being back here would be successful. Um, and, and that's step one. And then, you know, trying to win the championship is, is always very special. And then trying to go to really a, a, a bowl game and, uh, would be kind of what, what college football is all about. So, uh, you know, it could be a dream scenario, but, you know, still we get a lot of work ahead of us. But, uh, you know, anytime you're, as I go back to what I said, if you, you reach a goal, then you, you've had success. Well, I, I think there's, there's more of an interaction. Our guys are involved in the community more, especially in the summer, helping the kids in Holyoke, um, being out more, you know, certain things that way, the Special Olympics, we've got some guys helping there. and. In a community, and I think that there's there's a, you know, go, be, not being on campus for three years and coming back, there was some certainly excitement. The first game against Bowling Green, even though we didn't win the game, but there was an exciting game. Um, so I, I think what I'm getting from the players, I probably don't get on campus as much as I should, but that there's there's an excitement certainly from our administration um, that the students are you know ready for the. The Temple game will be the second game, will be the first game at Foxborough, and then, you know, our Florida International will be back at McGurk. So I think that um, the things that we did well last year will resonate with those people. And I'm getting that feel when I, when I go around town, or, you know, certainly the Notre Dame game is a lot of people have gotten tickets for that, and that I've seen in town. They say, oh, I got my ticket, I got my package, and, you know, so those things weren't happening last year.